Yo, what's going on guys? The Atlas in here coming at you with my next installment of HeroCraft. Yes, I know. As you can see behind me, we have done a lot, and I mean a lot, to oops, to our little townish community. Um, I finished the little wheat build. Why is this door open? What? How the hell? These cows have been giving me so much trouble. I know that's new too. I finally got my cow farm going to, um, well for now that's going to be, that's not going to be, um, permanent. Because I'm just going to get enough, whoa, that's loud. Get enough leather to make a, enough bookcases for my enchantment table and enchantment room. But I don't know how they're getting out. I think it's overpopulated and they just jump on each other because I have a, pig farm over here I'm not farm but pig pen just for food and here's my to-do list and just to remind me of what I have to do on here and so you guys can see in storage room animal farm for both pigs and cows and hopefully I can find some sheep over in the distance and enchantments which means enchantment table because right here I have my wheat farm going and that's been pretty good that's supposed to be a well soon for like water purposes so yeah this um this wheat farm has been actually treating me very nicely it's been working out I still need to make a hopper so that the all the goods drop down here oh I'm not wearing my armor look at my new skin well it's not new I just added eyes because I don't know I felt I felt weird just wearing glasses and alright so I guess you're that was your you saying you want to die just going out here also I did do a little decorating on the lower floor of my house a little kitchen area I might spruce that up a bit putting stuff here if I get um what's it called a brewing stand could be right there I used I incorporated a chimney in the house a little table here with pistons oh I think a zombie took down my door. Huh. That's weird. I was off the server. Um. So, yeah. And today, I decided... Oh, and we added the walkways. And today, since the storage room is first on our to-do list, I thought we could start off doing that. So, right here, I'm using wooden jungle slabs. Because, look at this. Look at all the jungle trees I have to choose from and I'm, I'm trying to get o a lot of oak trees and spruce I need birch I love birch wood but I just can't seem to find one to get the saplings so here's all our needed materials I need more jungle wood slabs well actually maybe I don't yeah I kind of do I don't need that much so maybe half and let's see boom boom and let's finish them off so now we're up to at least a stack and a half, maybe? Close to it. So for the look of the storage room, I decided I don't want like a normal house looking thing. I've seen a couple designs on YouTube and other YouTubers' um, channels. And since I have this dense forest of trees and I don't really use oak wood that much, I decided that it would be cool to make kind of a tree house storage room incorporating with the um, stone slabs and the oak leaves as steps and you'll if you don't get what I'm saying right now you'll get it soon because I'm gonna get working on it right now so for time purposes as usual I'm gonna cut it up and I'll see you back when I you know get all that down so just wait around all right guys and we're back and right here I'm gonna show you what I've been working on. Don't worry about the chest right there. That's just gonna that's gonna be transformed into a stone slab as soon as I get the chest thing working because I don't have anywhere to put my goods. Look at all that. And so it's kind of a secluded off area. So as you walk in, I really do like the look of the oak leaves and the stone slabs so using as a walkway go up here make a little turn now this is all gonna be like all oak leaves probably all around me and I'm not gonna make it a big square I'm gonna make it look like I'm in a tree 
little holes to peek out, you know, some lighting here and there. Maybe, and I was thinking about putting glass panes to look out. I think that would be nice. So as we get up here, this is going to be the level it's going to be on. It, this is mainly going to be a square room, but on the outside, I'm going to make it look like a treetop, like right here. It's just going to be mixed in leaves, but I'll just give you a nice little look. Just flatten it out for you so you could kind of visualize what I'm going for. I think it's going to be really cool. Oh, and by the way, guys, I'd just like to say I've reached 70 subscribers in less than two weeks, or actually more than two weeks of having this YouTube channel. It really means a lot that you... Oh, it means a lot that you guys are really, um, you know, promoting me and liking all my videos, commenting of what your opinion is. It really does mean a lot to me, and um, I'm trying my best to get as active as possible. Oh my God, I keep falling through that. So um, yeah, just keep keep up the good work, and I'll keep pumping out content for you guys. So right here. It's just going to be all flat, and it's just going to be chests all around, and I really think it's going to look cool. So, while I work out, uh, work on that, that's probably where I'm going to end the episode. And you guys really need to tell me if you want these episodes to be longer, because I don't want to make um, longer episodes of me building, or like not cutting out, if you guys don't want it. So, please tell me if you want these videos to be longer, because I love doing them for you guys. I love hearing your feedback. And, oh, by the way, there m might be a chance of me having a Feed the Beast series on this channel if I can get on the ser on a server and actually know what I'm doing. So, enough of pointless jumping around and talking. Hope you guys enjoyed the video as always. This has been Adolescent Hero, and I'm out, guys. Peace. <laughs>